The Falthalbit 77, or FH-77, was developed by Bofors to meet requirement of the Swedish Army. First prototypes were completed in 1973. Production of the initial FH-77A version commenced in 1978 and ceased in 1982. Current status of the FH-77A is uncertain. Most likely that these field howitzers are no longer in frontline service due to their age. This Swedish field howitzer was unusual in many ways. It was a very advanced weapon for its time. The FH-77A was fitted with auxiliary power unit, which was used for auto propulsion on roads and in firing position. This power unit also assists in placement and displacement of the howitzer, as well as loading of ammunition. The FH-77A has a 155mm L38 ordnance. It fires Swedish 155mm separate loading ammunition, which is not compatible with the standard NATO 155mm howitzer ammunition. The ordnance has a service life of 4,000 shells. This howitzer fires high explosive, smoke, illuminating and cargo shells with 72 dual-purpose anti-tank and anti-personnel bomblets. Maximum range of fire with a standard high explosive shell is 24 kilometers. This howitzer can reach 30 kilometers with extended range shells. The howitzer is fitted with a hydraulic 170 kilograms capacity crane, which loads ammunition. This crane picks up a pack of three shells and loads them into the loading tray of the howitzer. Charges are loaded manually. Though the shell and the propellant charge are rammed mechanically using an automatic load assisting system. It loads the howitzer at any elevation. Unfortunately, there is no option for manual loading. This artillery system is operated by a crew of six. Emplacement time is around two minutes. In theory a crew of two can emplace the howitzer and fire at a rate of up to 12 rounds per minute. It can launch a first burst of three rounds within 14 seconds. If the power unit fails the crew can use manual hydraulic pumps in order to continue operation. The FH-77A has a split trail carriage. However unlike most other field howitzers it lacks a central plate. Still though it is capable of wide angles of traverse and elevation. This artillery system is fitted with auxiliary power unit, developing 80 horsepower maximum road speed of this howitzer was limited to 8 km per hour auto propulsion of the FH-77A is used only over short distances. This artillery system was normally towed by a Sobskania SBAT 111S 6x6 truck, which carries entire crew and ammunition. Interestingly once the FH-77A is towed over difficult terrain, the truck driver could remotely start the power unit of the howitzer and engage his driving wheels for additional pulling power of the coupling. 